possibly the greatest invention of all time. Pop it on your door, and voila! You hang it off the back of the door, and then you can hang ties, caps, jackets, whatever. Where did I get it? Tiger. The most random, but also one of the coolest shops of all time. I love little markets, although they're dangerous for me with a wallet full of cash going in there. It's 99.9% .9 guaranteed that I will be leaving there with 0%, but thankfully I only had 35 euro. And I got that cool little thing about compassion, I love that word. Um, grateful, compassion and mindful are three things I try and remember every day. I'm going to curse less, I've cursed a lot in my vlogs, so every day. That one's a bit strange but you get the message it's putting yourselves in other people's shoes and how you treat other and um, what else oh yeah so i got random stuff this shop tiger is dangerous yes i bought a little box a passport cover this is what happens when you don't drink some sneaky nuts and then this is the real purchase goji berries one euro for these packets and this is a nice tasty super food it's Saturday night, gonna go hit the gym and do a push, did pull last night, so push tonight, maybe legs tomorrow, and then I'm taking some time off, I have a week off to study for my exam, so that's what I'm gonna do. trainers as well but uh, for the cost of this gym like I really recommend this is actually the upstairs area one two six on the money so absolutely delighted with that um, where are the so obviously I've been going since February 8th or 7th um, but I kind of wrote these goals down after a few weeks as I was, my confidence grew. Um, you don't actually see 126 there but this only shows every two weeks so I'm on track for 125 next Saturday. Like around one a week, like one is, is a good bit a week um, I don't want to be like losing muscle but um, at 126 kilo, I think it's okay to lose a kilo a week, but that's just what I'm doing anyway. And you know, I'm obviously not an expert or a trainer, but that's what's working for me. So I'm delighted. I kind of played with fire this week by not really prepping all my food. I just was kind of sick of cooking. I wanted to take a break from the cooking. I had a lot of visitors this week, and. Um, you know, I won't say I didn't have the time, I probably could have cooked, but I just didn't feel like cooking, so I ate out a good bit, but I kept an eye on my calories during the day, because it's hard to track calories when you're eating out in the evening times of, you know, burritos and the likes, um, so that's the crack. That's it, thanks for watching, I really, really appreciate you watching, because uh, it took me a while to get this up and running, so for people to comment and uh, tell me that they, they're enjoying the videos, or if they see me, one guy seen me in the gym, he said he was enjoying it, so that means the world to me, uh, and um, keep, keep, I'll keep it up, and uh, keep supporting me, I do appreciate it, and that's it. Oats, pumpkin seeds, goji berries, and kiwi, about four servings of oats, because I'm going to train legs later on, so there's about 80 to 100 grams of carbs in that, and then a little bit of honey, just to give it some flavour. Sunday the 8th of May, day number 8, I'm going to go and train legs, I'm a bit tired, I was out quite late last night. Got my new gym bag.
When you want to get off the darkest ground The gravity pulls you straight down Earth from a bird's eye view You should grow feathers and see this too exam tomorrow so I'm gonna hit the books now for my last bit of cramming I've been back home in Nice County Kildare studying for the week took some days off in the gym finally got to go back to the gym tonight um, did a little pu push session so feel good three days rest played some golf on Thursday I was really tired after that did a push day today and I might train tomorrow and Sunday and then I go back on the study buzz for the week because I just can't do both. I can't really do the gym and study. I probably could, but I find it difficult. So it's quite late. Finishing the gym, I quartered it, bombed it down on my bike to make it to Boojum. Kind of had to sneak in. They had the doors closed, but I uh, got my burrito. So uh, I'm very happy it's in my gym bag and I'm about to go and eat it. <laughs> You know I had to go to Unero. Unero. It's that goddamn good. So um, I'm gonna get down to business. out because I couldn't stay there they were looking to go home they had a long day but um gotta have that bougie experience so I got my hot sauces on deck and some napkins because bougies are always or burritos in general are a messy affair this is quite good I went with Mexican rice beef black beans sweet corn salsa mild salsa no sour cream and some cheese because I love cheese that's about it. Um, I've been eating clean all week, eating healthy. In fact, if anything, I think I've under-eaten. So we'll see what I weigh tomorrow morning before my exam. The goal is 125, and I'm pretty confident that even after this burrito, I'll be hitting 125. So stay tuned for the morning weigh-in. Oh my god, that was just so good. Yeah, I mean, it, it really just makes me so happy to to eat a burrito, they're, they're that good. I'm gonna curse less on the blog. I didn't realize how much I cursed, but um, I'm just so happy. Anyway, I better wash my face and do some last minute crime. <clears throat> okay. Mm. So, Saturday morning, the 14th, weights on track, 125.6, I believe it was this morning. Um, which is pretty good, I'm pretty happy with that. What the goal is to get down in the 125 range. And now I'm gonna hit the road. Got my little school bag, my aluminous helmet to keep me safe while I'm vlogging out there on the streets of Dublin. And my bike, I'm heading out to Marino, it's about a 30 minute cycle. Do my exam, cycle back into the city. Might get a sneaky B O B O O J U M. Y'all know what that is.
absolutely smashing day. Made it out here to Marino. Uh, 30 minute cycle through the city. It was fantastic. It's just such nice weather to be out on the bike. Gonna be nice and sweaty now going into the exam, but uh, I've got an hour to kill, or maybe 45 minutes, so I better go in and read over my answers, and I'll let you know how it goes. It's burrito time. Celebrate the end of a long week with a nice double meat. I think I'll go chicken, maybe chorizo, brown rice, sweet corn salsa, mild salsa, maybe sour cream because it's the weekend, but maybe not. And some cheese. Being a friend here. This is a new one on Abbey Street. They have one on Abbey Street, Kevin Street, and they have one on Lenny Walkway. So, uh, yeah, gonna go in and enjoy. There's so much food in that bowl that they couldn't even close it, so I mean, you can't ask for any more than that. 